They're learning TikTok dances and they're fighting back. Yo! Oh! Huge car chunk so they could be safe. Sport Barry cops are on the way. We are starting off the day with some bad news. So recently I got one of those electric skateboards that like flies. This thing goes like 40 miles per hour. And I use it to get from the RV to the bathroom so I can shower. I decided to take my daily stroll to go shower after I was done magnificent and I fell and my back's all scratched. But the worst part is, ah, well it's already broke so it doesn't matter. I broke my phone. The phone that's been with me for forever. The whole top of the screen doesn't work. So unfortunately, I gotta go get a new phone before I go out magnificent today. I don't know, I thought I'd give you all a little story time before we got started today. We got some good spots planned for today. We're going back to the same area that I was in yesterday where we found the pay phone and a bunch of other really cool stuff. After I stopped by the AT&T store and spend a lot more than I should on a stupid phone. We're heading to the spot. All right, well we just made it to the first bridge of the day. We actually are gonna have to keep an eye on the weather once again. I just got a notification on my phone saying that we are under a tornado watch right now, which is like, dude, I swear, we've been having so many run-ins with bad storms here recently. I, I don't know what's up. Hopefully we're gonna find some good stuff. This is looking juicy already. I already see some little oil splashes already. That's good, man. All right, we're gonna start down here. All right, first throw, there was a magnetic click, like straight down. Let's just kind of explore a little bit. Damn, bro, what the hell is that? It's magnetic. That does not want to move either. Come on, let loose. It's right there. Oh, it's coming. It's so heavy. That's a piece of a car, isn't it? Oh my gosh, I don't know what that was. It was full of mud though. Oh, we got it. It's like a bumper of a car. Look at that, that's why it's so heavy. Dude, I wonder if there's a whole car down here, man. I'm getting so many big clicks right here. It's like the whole front of the car. It's not even just the bumper. It's like the front of the frame. Oh, that mud can come out though. And make it like 100 pounds lighter. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, it's the front of a truck. Oh my gosh, man, that hasn't even been down there that long. Look at that, man. That's where the license plate would go. Well, that's one hell of a first find right there. I bet you there's gonna be so many pieces of this car down there. I bet you that's what's on the other side too. It looks like a Chevy, but I could be wrong. Yeah, it's the whole front frame. Well, that's one good way to start the day right there. It really makes me wonder what all those other really big things I can't get up are. Oh, there it goes, it's coming. What is that? It's like some sort of frame. Here, come here. Here we go, it's coming up. Oh, it's an old swing. Got it. I got it. There we go, man, it's an old swing. Dude, why are we finding so many big things? I'm taking like two throws now. All right, there we go. Two for two on big finds. I got a good feeling, man. I got a good feeling about this spot. There's something straight down, I got it. Oh, it's a motor. Here we go, we got our first electric motor of the day. All right, we'll take that. I always like finding those, man. Those are worth way more at the scrapyard right there. I know last time we took them, we got 15 cents a pound for these suckers. That really has not even been down there for too long. You just see it's got just a little bit on there. Immediately clicked on something. Yeah, it's some sort of frame. That also looks like it has not been down there for very long. I have no idea what kind of frame that goes to. All right, well, we'll take it, man. It's gonna be good scrap. You can tell it's all cut up. I think what we're working with here is this is someone's chop shop dump site. Every little bit of the car they didn't want or trying to get rid of is probably down in the bottom of this river here. Cause there's a ton of oil all the way out there again. Dang, that thing's got some weight. Oh, it's going weird. Oh, it is a chair. We got a lawn chair. All right, why is it so heavy though? Oh, it's tied. No, it's tied. It's a lawn chair tied down to something. Yep, I got something different. I had the lawn chair, but now I got this thing. I don't know what it is, but we're gonna throw it over there. Not the lawn chair, but something different. Just more, for, dude, that is like just thrown in there. Like that, that could not have been down there for very long at all. It almost looks like some crutches. All right, there we go. Well, we got a little piece of some crutches. Is it a bowl? Some sort of like casing or something. I don't know. It could be like a cooking pan, but I think it's a little small for that. Got some bolts. There is a lot of fishing line down here, unfortunately, holding a lot of this stuff down to the bottom. We might have to bust out the claw. It is starting to rain a little bit too. Might have to go check the weather in a little bit just to make sure we're not about to get wiped off the face of the earth. That was also straight down from that pile. Oh, it's a signpost. Oh, come on, stay on. Does it have the full sign or is it, it is just the signpost. 
man, this gets me excited that all this stuff is just freaking fresh. Like, I mean, it's been down there for a little bit, but not nearly as long as usually. Dude, if we find a gun, it's gonna be fresh. I have a feeling. All this stuff looks like it's been recently done. Do you know what's crazy? This I wasn't even gonna come to this spot. This is just one I passed along the way. Oh yeah, I got a little something. That's why it felt weird. All right, come here. Oh, we got two things. Just a little bracket and a little pipe. The cool thing about having that bumper is I can just use that as my bucket. <laughs> Don't even need to dump out my bucket. Stay on, baby, stay on. That's a good weight. Come here. Oh, it just got a lot lighter. Oh, it's a sign. All right, well, we got our first yellow striper of the day. Oh, it's just a baby yellow striper. He's not even full grown yet. We might have to throw him back. No, I'm just, I'm just kidding. It's got a smaller signpost on there. Usually the signposts are like that. We got our second, well, I guess it's the first sign, second sign post of the day. Bro, I'm liking this pile, man. Also, if you guys want to get into magnet fishing for yourselves, go check out battlemagnets.us. The link's down in the description. If you want to help support us. Oh my gosh, I got something again, dude. This spot is loaded. Oh, it's more that frame. Anyways, Battle Magnets like you has the links down in the description if you guys want to go find some cool little goodies of your own. All right, it's more of probably that porch swing. Dude, this pile is getting fast. I like spots like this, man. It's just like every other throw. And there's a lot more big stuff too. I'm just getting the easy stuff right now. I'm coming back with Blake and we're, we're gonna clean up one day, man. We're gonna get some freaking goodies here. Oh, we got a file. I don't know why we find so many files down in the bottom of the river. I, I don't know. We always, I've been finding a lot of files around here. I wonder if they used it when they were like making the bridge or something. Ooh, fish jumping. Man, it's so quiet. You can literally hear everything. I got something coming. What do we got? Oh, we got a little circle. Oh, is this a piece of a sander? I don't know what that is. Oh, that might be a piece of an exhaust, like a smaller exhaust, like the, the back plate. I don't know. And we also got more frame. All right, throw that over there. Our pile, man, look at that. I don't know if it's just the, all the big stuff, but our pile's looking extra, extra juicy today. Oh, you, you are a plus size queen. Come here, baby. Oh shoot, it's still got the whole freaking axle on it. It's, a, bro, what? Dude, it's a signpost. Are you freaking kidding me? Dude, it had like a whole box on it. It's, oh my gosh. Dude, this was like a drop box or something. Look at that, that's wood. Yeah, that's what it was. It was a drop box. All the other wood fell off. Who knows what was inside there? It's like a mailbox or something. I thought it was a whole axle, but unfortunately it is not. All right. Well, it was some sort of mailbox, I'm pretty sure. Or a drop box. And if it was a drop box, I'm going to be upset because it just fell apart. Is it another one? It feels about that same weight. No! There's going to be a lot of stuff to my left too. Oh, this thing's so heavy. No! There's no way that's a signpost unless that's under something. It's definitely caught on something. What is going on here? Piece of a cast net, that's why. Dang it, there's a cast net on top of that thing. Dude, how have we not found a gun yet? Like, the last few days, we haven't been finding very many guns. We usually are finding about one a day for a long time, but not today, not the last week. Usually when I talk about it, I get one. So we're just gonna speak it into existence. Here we go, I got something. Is this the lawn chair that I've been trying to get? It is. All right, come on, come on. Yes, come here, baby. Let's go. We got it, man, we got it. There we go, we got the lawn chair. Heck yeah, man. That still might be usable. Oh yeah, bro, that is a usable lawn chair. We might have to save this one. All right, let's throw that in the pile. Bro, can we just take a second to admire the pile? Look at the pile. The magnet gods are blessing us today. All right, let's keep on going. Here we go, we got something. Oh, we got a dangler. Oh yeah, we still got the dangler. Oh yeah. Dude, look at, that's like pressurized. That was like squirt out of there really fast. All right, we'll throw that in there. Maybe it's another piece of a lawn chair, who knows. Bro, we have like almost doubled our last two days. I swear. The crazy part is I don't even think I had this bridge marked. So I'm still 20 minutes away from the spot I had marked. Yeah, we got a bed frame. All right, come here. Got a little bed frameage going on. It is going everywhere right now. This thing is dancing, dude. We got a little dancer, bro. I don't know what kind of TikTok dance that is. Ow, it just freaking pinched me. That hurt. The, the fines are fighting back, y'all. They're learning TikTok dances and they're fighting back. I think the Supreme Court is probably gonna use that video in defense to ban TikTok. Come on, what is it? It's another yellow striper. Let's go, baby, we got a yet another striper. 
That thing was probably under everything or really far in the mud. Dude, we are doing amazing right now. Oh my gosh, it's like every thrower, like we haven't found like barely any little finds. I don't want to jinx us or anything, but dude, like that is amazing. That's a whole day's worth of magnification finds in the last like 20 minutes. I love spots like this, man, though, because if you notice, we really, besides the signs, we really haven't had any repeat finds. It's all different stuff. So you like really never know what you're gonna pull up. Oh man, this is about as heavy as the bumper. What was that? No! That was about as heavy as the bumper. We got something coming. What is this? Oh, it's a dangler. All right, come here. Oh, we got our first piece of rebar of the day. It would not be a magnet fishing trip without a piece of rebar and some scrap, but that scrap's probably coming off whatever the heck we're messing with. Look at this thing, man. It's some animal jaw, but I don't know. Maybe it kind of looks like a possum. Throw that over there. This guy definitely just turned around, so hopefully he doesn't bother us. What's up? Way. Really? Put a sign up that says no fishing. Where at? Right here. Where is it? No, I'm messing with oh man, oh I was like, dang man. Yeah, that was me. <laughs> I was a little bit confused. I was like, I'm not even close to Port Barry. I had no idea what they were talking about for the first second. I was like, where's the no magnificent sign? I was like, I've never seen one of those before. But they were talking about the video where the cops kicked me out. Friendly people in Louisiana, except for the police. Oh, we got a piece of a barbed wire fence. Oh yes. There we go, some barbed wire. Ooh, and a poke. Lots of pokes. Yeah. Oh man, all this sweat is getting on my back. Where I got road rash, it does not feel good. The salt in the wound. Yo! Oh! Bro, he tried to kill me. He passed out a double yellow. He was coming at me. People be wild out here. Oh, we got a little something. It just looks like a nail or something now. Uh, I don't know what that is. It's got like nuts on it. All right. See, this is what I'm talking about though with all this oil. Like, I don't know if y'all can see it, but there's some right there, there, there. It's everywhere, man. All right, we got something coming. What do we got? Oh, what is that actually? That is very odd looking. We got a chain. All right. We got a chain to go with it. Okay, like, I don't know, random chain. And then we got this thing. I don't know what it is, but it's going to the scrap yard. All right, we'll keep on throwing, man. There is a really big pile of stuff right here. All right, here we go, I got something. I don't know what it is, but it's heavier. <laughs> All right, just a big old chunk of metal, some bolts and some nails. All right, this one has officially made it out of the mud. Yo, what is that? What the heck? Bro, what is that thing, man? Dude, I saw it. It like had, was that a sign? Dude, this might be a railroad sign, actually. Oh my gosh, it's freaking huge. What? It's a satellite dish, I think. Is it? Oh man, come out. Dude, this thing is massive. Oh shoot. I think it's a satellite dish. It's something weird. That's gotta be a satellite dish, man. Is it? All right, cool, man. That thing's pretty freaking big. I'm just gonna have to figure out a way to like break it in half. <clears throat> Gotta get in the trailer, man. Yeah! I am him. Ah! There we go. All right, now we can actually throw it in the pile. It's gonna fit in the trailer. We just needed to do a little bit of adjusting. Well, our trailer's gonna be freaking full. We've been about due for a spot like this, man. Here we go. I got something again. What is that? Oh, it's a lawnmower. Are you kidding me? This is what I'm talking about, dude. That is a whole lawnmower. The entire lawnmower is down there. Bro, like how am I gonna get that thing up by myself? It's an entire freaking push mower. All right, yeah, I'm not gonna mess it up. I know where it's at. We're gonna come back with Blake and get that, but that's what I'm talking about, man. Who knows what this big stuff is that we can't get up? They are such big clicks. They could be huge car chunks or they could be safes. Oh my gosh, this is really heavy. Oh, what is that? Bro, shut up, that's another payphone. I just found a payphone yesterday. Dude, I've not found a payphone in like probably eight months and I found two in the last two days. The only one had money in it, so maybe this one's got some money in it. I'm probably gonna have to move that freaking lawnmower to be able to get it now. See, there's another reason why if I wasn't by myself, I'd be able to get it. Finny left me. All right, well, that's just another thing we know is down there. I don't even want to like waste too much time on it just because I know I could probably find five other things by the time I get that one thing up. Oh, look at that, man. That oil's got to be from that lawnmower. That is why it's got to come out of the water right there. You see all that oil or gas leaking like that? Look at all the turtles living here, man. 
We gotta do it for the turtles. I really feel bad that I can't get this thing up today. I want my turtle friends. Oh, there's a gun case out right there. A little gun casing. Bullet casing, my bad. Here we go, I got something coming. Oh, it looks like just a bunch of nails and little junk. Uh, it's just some weird little nail. All right, we got something. All right, come out. Some sort of can. Oh, it's one of those old beer cans. We've been finding so many of these. A schliz? A schliz? <laughs> I don't know. It's an old beer can right there. Brewed in Los Angeles, Memphis, Winston-Salem. 1976. That's an old can right there. Man, it is sunny, dude. It just went from no sun to sun. And no traffic to like freaking NASCAR going on right here. All right, here we go. We got a couple little goodies right here. Oh, we got a piece of an old jar right there. Look, it's even so, <laughs> well, it's still got a little bit of the glass on it. We got just a bunch of little scraps here, a little shotgun shell. All right, man, dude, we freaking cleaned up today. Well, this spot was certified loaded. Oh, move fast, move fast, move fast. All right, guys, that is gonna wrap up today's video. Thank y'all so much for watching all the way to the end. If you guys have made it all the way to the end of the video, comment loaded down in the comments. This spot was absolutely packed full of stuff. We have not had a spot like this in a very, very long time. I had to get on the, out of there pretty quick. I had to fill up the trailer as fast as I could without getting smashed by a car. So, I'm gonna let y'all go. I will see y'all tomorrow. Peace.